Hi guys, welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider pre-build for the dev channel, which is the build 23585. And this build for the dev channel has a few interesting improvements for the Windows 11 operating system, of course, a few fixes, and we're also noting some known issues that can be encountered in this build. So if you enjoy videos like these, in which we talk about different Windows 11 Insider preview builds, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future updates like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, Microsoft announces that now the camera app, Cortana, Photos app, People's app, and remote desktop client can now be uninstalled in this build. We're also getting a snipping tool update. So to get that, just open the Microsoft store and then just navigate to the library section and then make sure you get all the updates and snipping tool should be updated automatically. Basically, this snipping tool update improves HDR display support, screenshots, and screen recording on display. So with HDR enabled, should be able to better display colors. Of course, the highlight for the dev channel build should be the new location for Windows Copilot. Basically, Microsoft is testing a new location for the Copilot icon in the right side of the system tray. I think that is pretty interesting. This was discovered by Phantom Machine 3 on Twitter, so shout out to him. And basically, now when you open Copilot in Windows, you can click again on the icon to close it, which is a nice little addition for Microsoft. And this should be pretty useful because you can quickly close it, quickly open it. It's a bit delayed at the moment, but of course, Microsoft will improve this in the near future. Please let me know below in the comments if you prefer the Copilot location that is being tested on the dev channel or you like the Copilot icon being located near the other icons in the center or in the left of the taskbar. And of course, you can always go and right click on the taskbar, taskbar settings, and then uncheck Copilot and normally it should disappear from the taskbar. Of course, with this new addition that is being tested at the moment, the taskbar setting and basically unchecking Copilot doesn't work at the moment. But of course, Microsoft will work on that in a future Fly. In the file explorer, Microsoft of course did some visual changes to tabs. There was basically a small bug which showed a thin line when the scaling was greater than 125% and this is now fixed. This was also noticed by Phantom Machine 3 on Twitter. And lastly, for the new features in the settings app and then in the personalization section and then Copilot and Windows, now the slider open in Copilot when Windows starts is working properly. So basically, when you open your Windows operating system with this toggle on, Copilot should automatically automatically start if you are using a wider screen. I made a video a few days ago in which I showed you how to enable this. So if you don't have it on the dev channel, make sure to watch that video. Now let's talk about a few fixes. We have a general fix, fixed a few issues leading to Explorer.exe crashes. Related to the file explorer, Microsoft fixed an issue causing the context menu to draw off screen when invoked using touch or pen on the side of your desktop. And related to the taskbar, Microsoft fixed the issue causing the purple chat button to show up again on the taskbar after updating to build 23580. And we have only one known issue related to Copilot and Windows. When first launching or after refreshing Copilot and Windows while using voice access, you will need to use the show grid commands to click in the ask me anything box for the first time. So basically, this is all there is to it in the latest dev channel build. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.